The relation 3t is equals to square root of 3x plus 6. Describe the displacement of a particle in one direction. Where x is in meters and t is in seconds, the displacement when velocity is 0 is. In this question, we have to find out the displacement of the particle when velocity is 0. So, first of all, we want velocity by using this equation. Take the given equation. 3t is equals to square root of 3x plus 6. Square root of 3x is equals to 3t minus 6. Squaring on both sides, 3x is equals to 3t minus 6 whole square. This is like a minus b whole square form. 9t square minus 36t plus 36. Divide with 3. 3t square minus 12t plus 12. The rate of change of displacement is called velocity. So, differentiate with respect to time. 3 into d by dt of t square minus 12 into dt by dt plus d by dt of 12. dx by dt velocity 3 into differentiation of t square becomes to 2t. Minus 12 into dt by dt is 1. And here differentiation of only constant is 0. Then velocity is equals to 6t minus 12. Now we have to find out displacement when velocity is equals to 0. Substitute 0 in place of velocity. 0 is equals to 6t minus 12. And from this 60 is equals to 12 and time is equals to 2 seconds. Now we know time. Substitute t is equals to 2 seconds in this equation. x is equals to 3 into 2 whole square minus 12 into 2 plus 12. 4 into 3, 12 minus 12 to 24. Plus 12. 12 plus 12. 24. Plus 24. Minus 24. 0. What about displacement? 0. When velocity is equals to 0, then displacement also 0. Correct option is fourth option.